Pike. It's all on this USB drive. All the evidence you need to nail Typhon for Gabe's death and plenty more. All right. Bring it with you. I'll meet you in an hour. Thanks. Talk soon. Citizens of Haven Springs, we are live at the Spring Festival. One final reminder to head over to the Lathe flower cart and grab a rose before they're gone. At Haven's inaugural Spring Festival, eligible women of good stock and birthing age would offer up roses in order to attract a mate. What can I say? History is weird. Thankfully, we've lost the mating stuff, but kept the roses. And if you do have a special someone in mind, a rose is a great way to say you care. And an even better way to say, hey look, a rose. Sounds fun. Is giving away a rose something I'd do? Maybe. I can decide downstairs. For now, I'll grab the USB stick. Traditionally, you give roses to your crush at the Spring Festival, so... I've never had a girl give me flowers before. I'm sorry. I didn't know you cared so much about traditional gender roles. I'll get back to my butter churning and doilies. Shut up. You first. I would do anything to put the two of them back together. For now, I'll grab the USB stick. Okay, time to head downstairs. Test, test. Check, check. Check. Holy shit, you own a skirt? Hey, guys. Happy first spring fest. Thanks. I need to apologize to you guys. What happened in the apartment... Something really messed me up. These past few weeks, I thought I had a handle on my emotions. But after what happened with Charlotte, it's the same old story. I lose control and I hurt the people I care about. Sorry. Yeah. Fuck that. If anyone needs to apologize, it's me. Ever since we've met, you've been there for me. And then when you're the one struggling, I bail. Not cool. I'm really sorry. If we're both sorry, does that just cancel everything out? I think so. We're back to normal. <laughs> Not to spoil the moment, but Typhon blew up their own mind. Why? I don't know yet. But we have all the evidence we need to nail them for Gabe's death. I got a hold of Pike. He'll be here soon. 
Once he sees what's on that stick, it's over for Typhon. Hence the celebration. <laughs> I think we've all earned the right to enjoy ourselves a little tonight. The band's coming on soon. You'd better be front and center. Oh, Rad. Do you need help setting up for the show? Nah, it's all good. We're almost there. I have to run back to the trailer. Go be a normal person for a while. Can't make any promises. Text me when it's ready. If I wanted to give away a rose, Steph and Ryan would definitely be on my list. Anyway, time to enjoy the festival. We're drugstore makeup from Seattle. We've got, um, merch. Dude, count me in. I'm dying. 232, 233, 234. Hi. Oh, hey. Nice to see you. You're taking this jelly bean thing very seriously. Yeah. Because the prize is a $100 gift card. Chrissy's been all anxious ever since she got lost. So, I thought I could get her a bunch of treats. Which is really embarrassing, saying it out loud. Not at all. That's sweet. Maybe I can help. Oh, for real? Are you good at this? How many jelly beans do you think there are? It's always more than you think it is. I'd say, like, 800 or so. Huh. Yeah, could be. Feels like something just changed in that lady by the jar. Maybe I should read her. 800's actually not bad. Hopefully they don't go lower. Oh, I was close? Maybe I should say something. Hey, I've got another guess. Yeah? I think it's closer to 700. Yeah, 700 feels right. But we have to get it exactly. Just felt that lady's heart skip a beat. I should read her again. Hear me, they're really close to 731. Who is this girl? Hell yes, your secret's mine. The answer is 731. Don't ask me how. 731 jelly beans. Hey, uh, hey, hello, everybody. Can I have your attention? Jed, what are you doing? I just wanted to take this opportunity to say, right here, in front of God and everyone, that Annette Teresa Foster is just the most beautiful woman in the world. They say the Spring Festival is about telling folks how you feel. And Anne, I feel like I'd just about die if I couldn't make you my wife. You had to go and make a scene, it didn't you? It happened last year. Yep. I remember it clear as day. I love that the radio station broadcasts live from the park. Looks like plenty of people are still out around town. No, Mom, it's not an emergency. Trust me, I'm fine. Typhon is not normal. 
I made a mistake Just coming here. Get out while you can, dude. Grand opening tomorrow. Gotta pull my shit together for this Free grand opening. Salad for spring These people won't be so days. gracious forever. We might. Free food goes a long way in Haven. Come on, son, get it over with. <laughs> I, I don't want to get sick. You're gonna feel a whole lot better after you do. I'm, I'm gonna die, Dad. Not tonight, you're not, birthday boy. Although I suspect you're gonna <laughs> wish you had tomorrow morning. Had a boy. Anyway, time to enjoy the festival. Lots of people still hanging out on Main Street tonight. The LARP was... A lot of fun. Yeah, it was. God, I still like her so much. Food left at the festival? What do I do? Sorry, man. Forbidden love is a bitch. Could be. But Damn it. Are you? I'm head over heels for this really. dark. But what do I do? Nice Wait, they're both into each other? Come on, people. Hey, um... It's the Spring Fest. You're both obviously into each other. Just make out already. What? <laughs> you heard me. Is it that obvious? Is what obvious? Fuck. Julia, I don't want to screw this up. What's obvious? Are we talking about the same thing? Look, if we weren't in the middle of the street, I would totally jump you right now. Uh, I... Do you want to come back to my place tonight? Maybe? Oh, oh my god. Absolutely yes. Alex Chen out here, covering Cupid's lazy ass. Her place. Tonight. Good luck making it till then. I am going to rock his world. You do that. Got some time to kill. Might as well wander around. Wait, is someone standing out past the Bridge of Flowers? Pretty late for a bus ride. I've never missed a spring festival before. Ever. Oh, honey. You'll catch the first few hours, and there will be other spring festivals. Actually, Nana, I might just wait at the bus stop. Avoid the parade of goodbyes. I'll cover for you. I 
I have a surprise for you. Good surprise. Didn't expect that surprise. him playing my favorite game would be a turn on. A but here we are. Get out. I'm romancing Melody. The nurse? She's adorable. I'll be real with you right now. Game is sick. I'm glad Eleanor made it out to the festival tonight. I'll have to say hello. I'll take a coupon. No coupons, my dear. Just tell me your name and I'll remember it. All right. Alex Chen. Alex Chen? Didn't we speak already tonight? Nope. Stupid. So stupid. Print some coupons, they said. It's a small town. I'll remember, I said. Oh, hubris. You know, you could try posting on my block. Whoever comments gets the deal. Well, that's a good idea. Best of luck. Gotta pull my shit together for this grand opening. These people won't be so gracious forever. Well, couldn't hack it in the ice cream biz shot. after all. Oh, but at least we gave it a shot. It sounds like they've reached the end. Of their rocky road. I'm the worst. The ice cream game yet. No. Hey, hey, I take. That's sweet, but I think I'll avoid touching this bench just to be safe. This is awesome. Favorite time of the year. Five. That kind of enthusiasm is infectious. Especially for me. So this is that whole communal gathering thing everyone's always going on about. Yep. I get it. I guess Riley is feeling sentimental tonight, but I haven't seen her around. Where is she? So then, where's the after party uh, this year? I just hope Riley after is doing all right. right. Oh no. Come on. What Young happened man to Riley? like yourself, you must know what the haps is. It's nice to see Jed so in his element. It's been a hell of a month. But this makes it all worthwhile. Jed loves this town so much. It's inspiring. I'm glad, Ellen. I win. Again. Guess I'm just not cut out for jelly bean counting. Best spring fest ever. And so... Hey, Steph. <laughs> hey, how's it coming? 
Oh, good. I'd say the chances of starting a fire are low to medium low. This is for you. Are you serious? Of course I am. Dude, thank you so much. This totally makes my night. I'm glad. Hey, could we meet up after the show tonight? I actually have some pretty big news to share. She said mysteriously. <laughs> of course. Speaking of, Ryan should be done any minute. Meet me there? Sure. Two-faced bitch. Sounds like Ryan is ready for me. I better head back. Hey! Oh, hey. Just in time. So, who's playing? Yours truly. Seriously? That's awesome! Well, wait, who else? Steph. Who else is playing? I hate you both. We didn't want you to wuss out. Wussing out is highly underrated. We haven't even practiced yet. Who cares? Everyone's wasted anyway. Just play whatever. I'll follow your lead. This is gonna be awesome. Trust me. Um, we've never played together before and... Uh, anyway, Sorry if this sucks. <sighs> Fuck it.
Hey, Charlotte. How deep do you think? The lake, I mean. I don't know. I felt horrible this afternoon. I didn't know if I could survive that feeling. But now... It's like when your leg falls asleep. And even though it's still attached, it's become something other than you. whole life, I've always felt so deeply, but maybe this is better? There's no shame in needing to feel numb for however long it lasts if it gets you through another day. I don't feel ashamed. But I take your point. Thank you. At least I can survive numbness. Good to see you, Alex. Have fun at the festival. Sounds like Steph wants to meet me on the rooftop. Uh, you said you have some news? I'm leaving. I'm actually leaving Haven Springs. Can you believe it? Back on the road again. Fucking finally. Wait, seriously? I'm gonna play music again, Alex. Anywhere I want. God, I forgot how fucking good it feels. <sighs> Holy shit, Steph, that's so cool. I'm really happy for you. You better keep in touch. You think it's that easy to get rid of me? Come on, Chen. I need a new destination. You're my good luck charm. You have shit taste in good luck charms. <laughs> Shut up. Pick one. Berlin. Fuck yeah. Bowie recorded Heroes in Berlin, and that record slaps. Where am I gonna live there? Some big loft with concrete floors and exposed brick walls. I'll brood on the fire escape, writing lyrics in my leather-bound journal, and drinking absinthe straight from the bottle. Ugh. Someday? They turn the place into a museum. 
Steph Gingrich recorded blah, blah, blah here. And it slaps. <laughs> That sounds like a pretty spectacular plan. Great. Then come with me. To Berlin? Sure, why not? Doesn't have to be our first stop, but one day. I still have friends in Seattle who book shows. Maybe we start there or, I don't know, Kansas City, Vegas, wherever we want. Look, I don't want to pressure you, but I've seen you give so much of yourself to make sure other people get what they need. And I guess I wonder if you've thought about what you need. I mean, obviously, I like you a lot. Alex. You mean the fucking world to me. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. don't have to decide anything now, okay? <laughs> Just think about it. I will. Thank you. I'm gonna head back down. Find me later. Hey, Gabe, can I tell you something? I think I solved it. Why you died, who's responsible, isn't that crazy? I'm out of threads to pull, which is terrifying because on the other side of all this, after Typhon, For you, there's just normal life. I was kind of counting on you to show me how to do that. But I think I can figure it out. I just wish you were here to see it. Oh, um, also, I kissed Steph, so... That happened.
Alex. Do you have the USB drive? I do. It's all here. Gabe's call, their secret plan, the cover-up. You need to come with me to the station. Alex? Don't make this hard. Probably isn't how you pictured your first spring festival, huh? Not exactly. Coffee? Coffee would be great. Thanks. I don't know why I offered we're actually out. Pike, why am I here? The long and short of it is, Diane is charging you with stealing her USB drive. What the hell are you talking about? Did you steal this USB drive or not? At least tell me you looked at it. I can't. Sorry. What do you mean? Why not? Well, one, I would need a warrant. And two, the case is closed. The order came down today. I did what I could, but, you know, the evidence just wasn't there. Sorry, Alex. The order came down today from who? High up. Boss's boss's boss. It's not my job to know. Look, what happened to my brother wasn't an accident. It was criminal. The files on that drive prove it. That could be true. But let's say it is. The issue is, you stole Typhon's property. I can't work with that. Okay, I get the point. I'm sorry I stole the drive, but... Apologizing isn't enough. Alex, you're not thinking about this clearly. Seems pretty clear to me. Diane wants to charge you with computer fraud. That's a federal crime, Alex. Five to ten, easy. You're telling me I might go to prison for this? For five to ten years? It's not that bad. Hey, I talked to her, and despite how angry she is at everything you did, she's willing to let it go. <laughs> if you agree to drop everything, Typhon won't press any charges. She's only offering that deal because she knows I have her. She's guilty, Pike. Even if you're right, your only evidence is inadmissible. I think you should do it. Fuck that. I'm not signing anything. Alex. No. 
Typhon buried something in the mountains. Something so massive, they ignored Gabe's call and set off the blast just to cover it up. Don't you want to know what it is? What do you mean, cover it up? Another blast, unannounced, set off at the exact same time at the old mining site. And all of it happened just a few weeks before inspections were set to begin. Come on, Pike. It's all right here. Like I said, it doesn't matter. Alex, please, just sign the form, and we can both go back to the party. No. Alex, this is not an offer that you can choose. I said no. No is not an option. What are you so scared of? See for yourself. Shit. What could be in that envelope? Alex, please. I don't want you to get hurt. Then help me, damn it. Fuck me. Is this a threat? What did you expect? Huh? The Typhon, a global organization with billions in revenue, an army of lawyers, and who knows how many politicians in their pockets would just what, throw up their hands and say, you got us. I thought I could get justice for Gabe. Yeah, well. Typhon has their own idea of justice. Shit. Believe me, I want nothing more than to make these fuckers pay. I've learned the hard way that it's not possible. They're too big. Too connected, too ruthless. You can hate me. If you want, call me a coward. But I don't want to lose you like we lost Gabe. Pike is terrified of Typhon. I bet if I took his fear away. But it's not just about me. Steph and Ryan are in danger too. Fuck. I want to hurt Typhon so bad. But can I really put their lives at risk along with mine? You 
you want to risk your life over this? Gabe, Mac, Alex, who's next? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Just keep your head down, Tony. You're just a shit heel. Typhon's major league. Typhon doesn't lose. Typhon disappears, people. Let them get killed, not you. I know you're afraid. I am too. I know you think that Typhon is too big, too invincible, but they're not. I will bring them down. I just need your help. If not for me, then for Gabe. Please. Fuck. I'll think about it. Thank you. Get the hell out of here. Really? Alex. Be careful. Those pictures. How long have they been watching us? And what will they do if... I have no idea what to do next. Maybe talking to Jed will help me feel better. First, I need to get out of this dress. It was special for me too, Steph. Enjoy that ice cream. Might as well go talk to Jed now. Hey, Jed. There she is. Have a seat. Something tells me you've had a more exciting spring festival than you planned for. You saw Pike arrest me. And let you go, apparently. Then there's that business with Ryan and Steph earlier today. I wasn't sure why it took all three of you to work out Diane's lunch order. I know you're used to looking out for yourself. Gabe was like that. But Haven's a community. We help each other. I want to help you. But first, 
You have to let me know what's going on. Fuck it. What have I got to lose? Typhon killed Gabe. I have proof. What proof? I stole it from Diane. Emails and documents proving there was a second explosion the night Gabe died. To cover something up, Jed. Some secret they buried. I don't know what it is. I don't even know what to do next. But I'm not giving up. Not ever. I know what they're hiding. Wait. You're telling me you knew that Typhon's crooked? This whole time? Typhon's the devil that runs this town. I've been carrying their secrets for far too long. I know what they buried in the mountains. Tell me. I'll do one better. I'll show you. There, up ahead. Where are we? Middle of nowhere. About two clicks that way is the mining site where you search for Ethan. Five clicks that way is town. What is this thing? Ventilation shaft. They're scattered everywhere. Over the years, mines grow into mines, creating a labyrinth under Haven. What you're searching for is down below. Chad, why are you sad? Sorry, kid. Okay. Just put the gun down. I tried to talk you out of it, scare you off. I was sure those pictures of Ryan and Steph would do the trick. But you were relentless. Won't leave damn well enough alone. You don't have to do this. I do. Twelve years ago, I made a mistake. The kind of thing that you, you can't undo. But Typhon made me a deal. A way to save my town. Give my boy a normal life. I never wanted Gabe to get hurt. Go to hell. 